fast. I don't need it. Let's just go. We got a family reunion to get to. You know, Virgil, it took us a long ass time to get up here. You showed up. You sure know how to throw a party. No food, no drinks, and the only babe just left. My sincerest apology, brother. I was so eager to see you, I couldn't concentrate on preparations for the bash. <laughs> Whatever. At any rate, it's been a whole year since we last met. How about a kiss from your little brother? Or better yet, how about a kiss from this? So, this is what they call a heartwarming family reunion, eh? You got that right. I'm 
Anybody want to know why Virgil do the things? He does. Yes. Now the spell Sparta cast will be broken. It's because when he was young, uh, when both Dante and Virgil were young, when it was a while with the discussion. I see a devil inside you has awakened as well. Wait. We should leave for the moment we have all that we need. You see, Dante. Well, you see, the thing is, when when their family was attacked, I mean, you guys already know. Spada fell in love with a human woman. Uh, then they had Dante and Virgil. Uh, obviously, this didn't sit well with the other demons, and they came and they attacked their family. Um, but you see, like when they was attacked, uh, Virgil was outside, and Dante was with his mom. Um, the, when the demons came, um, their mom. I don't even know the name of them all. I can't remember. But basically, she took Dante and tried to, like, run and to hide. She didn't know where Virgil was at. She thought, they already thought they, uh, they, I guess they thought that he was dead. Because he was nowhere to be found. They was attacking and shit. But Virgil was outside, and he, I think he got attacked by the demons. And he tried to protect himself, but he can't because he was just a little boy. And he got he got seriously hurt. And he saw Dante, his mom, and their mom run off. I guess making him feel abandoned. Oh, my God. 
That right there had to been the best damn cutscene in the whole game. And the best damn cutscene ever for the PlayStation 2. <laughs> Out of all the video games, I think that was the most badass thing we probably have ever seen. <laughs> And with that, the Devil Trigger has been unlocked. But yeah, like I was saying, uh, so Virgil, he got attacked by these demons and stuff. And he saw the mom run away with Dante, so I guess that made him feel abandoned. And then when he woke up hours later, he was still surrounded by demons that attacked him again. And he was just a little boy. Both Dante and Virgil, I think about the same age. And, um, yeah, Virgil just had these issues where he just feel weak and just powerless, unable to protect his family and himself. And so he's always just been, like, in search of more power and gotten better. He's gotten better at fighting just by, like, being by himself. And because he's got spider, you know, blood, he's half demon, half human. He can't really die easily. And so that gave him a lot of time for trial and error to get his fighting style right. Um... But eventually he did become, you know, quite skillful. But yeah, ever since then, Virgil has always been like, uh, kind of power hungry. In search of more power, of his father for, uh, power. Wait, I mean, Virgil doesn't really have too much screen time. We barely know too much about him. And the only reason I know about that was because of the comic books and the... Uh, oh, I didn't know you could break that. That looked like a secret. And it is. I don't want to do it. Oh, shit. What's this? Can I leave? I don't want to do the mission. What? Mission select? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's that's Virgil. Um, I'm trying to think. Is there anything I'm missing? Uh, other than their weapons was given to them by their father. Um. What was Virgil's weapon called again? His katana is called the what? The Yamato? The Yamato? I think it's called. It's special to him. I think. I don't know how the weapon was made, but I think Spider probably made it out of Virgil's blood, I guess. And that, and that terms the the sword is special. I mean, don't take my words for it. I don't know. I'm just guessing. But I'm guessing like the sword was made. You know, by a part of Virgil himself, that would make the the sword more special to him. That's why in Devil May Cry Five, when he stabs himself with it, it you know it gives like it's it does these certain things. Dante's sword can do that too. His sword, ha Dante. I mean, his sword is the rebellion. But like when you play Devil May Cry 1, the sword is a different sword. It's it's what, what was it called? Stone Age or something like that? Where is these others? Hang on, I'm trying to figure this out. Oh, I didn't see this in here. There's one more. Up here. Gotta be up here. Right? Oh yeah. We're basically in the Leviathan, the whale. It's supposed to be like a guardian or something. It's supposed to protect the tower or whatever. Protect the tower from what? I don't know. <laughs> it's not like humans can like uh easily get in this place. I mean you have to deal with the dog first. 
but it's supposed to protect <laughs> the tower, I guess, or a garden of some sort. It's just this flying well they put in the game. <laughs> and we're in it right now. Oh my. Yeah, we gotta kill the well. Screw some of its lines and stuff. Make it fall down. My question is Well, never mind, I changed my mind. I was gonna say something stupid. Woo! Oh my god! Go! Let me in! This is quite nasty. I can understand if you guys don't wanna watch this. I'm actually getting kind of woozy. I don't like nasty shit. What is that? I don't know. It's some sort of organism. Could be a whale's ass or fall, I know. <laughs> What is these demons doing in here? I have no idea. Woo! Come on! Woo! Okay. We got it. Whatever it is. Put your hands on it. Touch it. It's this hole. Where was that at? Um. I think we. That looked like his eye. I think it might be his eye. Okay. The intestines. Okay. Neat. What's in here? All right. Thank you. Woo! Let's get out of here. It's that squishy noise is making me uh. Well, it's not making me feel good. What was that? I'm fine. I am fine, I am fine, I am fine. I wanna get out of here. Oh my god, give it a rest, leave me alone. I use a devil trigger to get out of there. Stop it. Oh, yeah, 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 let's go back. What did a whale scoop down to eat a school bus? Hell if I know. Gotta get out of the acid. Eternal acid. Alright. Okay. Here we go. That's one down. Whoa! I forgot about that. Stop, dickheads! 
Virgil, like, what the fuck's wrong with him? Can't you feel it? The rage and agonies of the people. Those who were confined here, with their desires for evil being unfulfilled. It was all because Sparta slammed the door to the demon world in their faces. What's wrong? Nothing. So this is the next stage. Wait! If you're asking for a date, forget it. Because I make it a point not to go out with women who shoot me in the head. Date a demon? <laughs> I'm not that desperate. Besides, I really don't care for guys who stink like blood. <sighs> you're right. to you because I don't want to miss the party who counted on you anyway honestly why do you bother fighting them <laughs> it's, the, it's not like they're gonna stop respawning why fight them I say like, fuck them as soon as you kill them they're just gonna respawn. Cracks in the demon world are open. It's open. Man, I would hate to live in Devil May Cry reality. <laughs> God, I would hate that. Okay, I remember now. We gotta switch. Yeah, this bridge can like move around and stuff, but we gotta find the right controls. Um. Let's get a move on. Oh, what is this? Oh no! Yeah, I accidentally skipped it by accident. It's a cutscene where they just show some spiders. I I know. As soon as I walked in this room, and I realized the interior design, and I said, "This is this is where it starts, ain't it?" Yeah. I know some of y'all probably upset that I accidentally skipped that cutscene, but come on, man. It's not like I did it on purpose. And plus, come on. It ain't nothing but some 
stinky ass, nasty ass demon spiders. Woo! I tell you what. I don't know if this game got a gallery mode. But after I get done fighting Ian, I actually, you know what? Come on. Well, no, that's not what I meant to do. Dude, the game got like a gallery mode. I feel bad. Um. Can I watch the cutscene? Uh, I don't know. On enemies? This should be the last one I encounter, right? Yeah. Oh, I can't watch the cutscene. That's too bad. <laughs> oh well. Mm -mm. Sorry. Sorry about that, bud. <laughs>